St. Photios Greek Orthodox National Shrine. Built 1749 and restored in 1979. This shrine is dedicated to the memory of the 400 Greeks who arrived in St. Augustine in 1768, took on fresh supplies and journeyed south to help settle the colony of New Smyrna, Florida. After 10 difficult years, the survivors of that colony sought refuge in St. Augustine, where they gathered in the Avero House for worship. These pioneers comprised the first permanent settlement of Greeks on this continent. This is house is listed in the National Register of Historic Places. The Avero House, that's what, that's this, uh, this shrine. The Avero family lived on this property from 1712 until 1804 even before the existing building was constructed, with the exception of the British occupation period during 1763 to 1783. The restoration was undertaken to approximate the character of the building as it existed in 1753 to 1763 using documentary and archaeological evidence. The restoration process included reconstruction of a missing building section that commemorates its use as a place of worship, then called San Pedro Church led by Father Pedro Camps, who sponsored a preschool in 1787 with classes taught in Spanish until 1790. The coquina stone blocks, side entry, arcaded loggia, and flat roof are characteristics of prominent first Spanish period dwellings in St. Augustine. go here inside the shrine. The, uh, the entrance is free. Yeah. pretty in here. Looks like they've got the uh, pictures and bios of all the different priests that uh, are associated with the Greek Orthodox Church here in uh, the United States, metropolis of San Francisco, Denver, Detroit, Chicago, Pittsburgh, Atlanta, New Jersey, Boston. Vestments for the priest. Very colorful. And of course, the end. 
they have a little gift shop. Good morning. Trying. We didn't spend very much time inside. I have uh, I've been through the train before. Uh, it's definitely interesting if you uh, are here in St. Augustine, you know, stop in and uh, take a look, spend a little bit more time, and actually read the uh, the information 